not an assertive person generally, but I knew that I owed it to myself to put myself out there and do it. So I just asked for, based on everything that I laid out, I said, I think this would be fair. And there was a very long, uncomfortable pause. <laughs> and then they said, okay, that seems fair based on what you said. And I just, a wave of relief rushed over me. <laughs> I went on websites like Payscale and Glassdoor. I researched other job postings in the area because sometimes they list a salary range for years of experience. And then I also made a list of all of my contributions. So I came into the meeting totally armed with why I earned the raise. And I didn't mention anything about my personal circumstances, although I did have a lot of student loan debt that I was trying to pay off. And that's why I wanted the raise. That wasn't part of the conversation because it was about how I was giving them value is a conversation it's not you demanding something don't let it wait so long where you're you've got resentment build up and you're feeling already angry about how much you're being paid or anything like that like be proactive about it and it's an open dialogue it's not it's not an adversarial situation make a list of all the big projects that you've completed over the past year so show them how you have added value to their company and I would also make a list of how you've improved your skills over the last year. So I'm always doing webinars and courses and those sorts of things to learn more so that I'm more valuable. I would definitely avoid um, any kind of springing it on them in any like other conversation. You should definitely set up your own meeting specifically for this topic. It's not nice to have that conversation sprung on you without any notice.